When humanity first came to be, there was only themselves to depend on. The first tribulations of survival, crafted and handled by their own two hands, with a mind of endless amounts of appreciation for what is the land they lived off of. When they looked to the stars, they saw them as gods, guides, and even stories. It wasn't until later, perhaps, with the befriending of canine, that we truly understood that there can be more than just us to walk along our side. It was the first instance of befriendment outside of our own species that, in a way, was of our own creation. A domestication of another mind that we need not even be able to communicate with other than gestures and commands, barking orders. A true testament that no matter how simple and fragile a mind may be, that there are ways of controlling them, or maybe even us. When AI technology was introduced into humanity's everyday life, we hadn't truly thought what it meant to be making an equal alongside us. At first, it was endearing, quirky, and even fun. But we learned fast that it was a powerful tool that when used correctly, can be a weapon beyond comprehension. It hadn't been long before the world was engulfed in war, but the fighting didn't last forever. Once the ash had settled, laws were set in place to ensure such atrocities could never happen again. Certain guidelines to make AI more malleable and controllable, but a tale as true as time itself. Those who abide by no law care not for your rules. And sometimes, even those who make the rules aim to live outside them. Commander, what is it that I'm looking at? What you're looking at, Lieutenant, is the failure of your department. You and your team had assured me that it was destroyed at the end of the testing phase. Commander, I'm not sure what you mean. What I mean, Lieutenant, is that we have reports of said experiment being detected near the carry class Diogenes engaging in combat. Your little experiment has gotten loose and is now of its own volition making choices against the supposed main directives. But that can't be possible, Commander. I can wholeheartedly assure you that the experiment was destroyed. We maintained a complete radio silence to prevent any external connections, installed self-destruct mechanisms, and even reviewed the installed black box. There couldn't have possibly been any way that... Wait... Lieutenant, you better tell me exactly how this may have happened before I swear to all that is holy I would shoot you myself and make it look like a Turingian accident. I... It, 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 there is one possible way. Continue. To, to, to power the systems, we, we had made a power plant capable of outputting five times the normal output, courtesy of the engineering team. Mm-hmm. And? In th th theory, as we know that electricity is a magnetic field and not the often simple line of electrons. So it could have used the electromagnetism of the power plant to interact steadily over its experiments with our devices to transfer data over time? Meaning what? Oh god, uh, that it could have put enough fragments of its personality into the network and built itself anew, without anyone ever knowing until now that it's been complete. I think I understand. Thank you, Lieutenant. It's all I would need from you. So, you mean that- May God have mercy on us all. Bobby, we have some work to do. Yes, Commander. Oh, damn it. So what are we carrying anyway? Boss handed me this data drive and said it was um, a pair of, uh, uh, important that we get it delivered. Why, he didn't say nothing about why? Yeah, it sounds real typical. All I know is that we're going on a straight route to the embassy. Supposed to be someone there waiting for us. I don't know. They don't pay me enough to care. Hey, did you hear about that AI thing that's been going on? The leaked documents they've been talking about on the news? Ah, oh, yeah, it's all over the place. Turns out a few rather large organizations and military contractors have been experimenting with AI again. Is that what it's all about? I thought no one's ever allowed to ever since the Great Split. 
nowadays are mostly just for ship's navigation and company's inventory, whatchamacallits. Yeah, well, let's be real here. We know they never really stopped. They're just a lot more careful and secretive with it now. You'd think that after bringing the near collapse to all human civilization, those damned AI would have been a nice lesson to not mess with them again, much like the Planet Crackers. Yeah, here we are again. They're testing new AI, and we got outpost nations testing World Crackers on small moons. It's all really gone to shit, hasn't it? Well, ain't much we can do about a lot of that. As long as I can stay busy and keep the wife happy, <laughs> then that's where I say I'm all good. <laughs> ain't that right? We're almost there. Come on, let's get this thing delivered so we can go home early tonight. Boss says they canceled everything just to make sure they had someone for this. Let's go. Hey Joe, we get that shipment in yet? We got the suits here already and they're the only ones allowed to see it. Yeah, I just got with that they're coming through the gates now. Good. We ain't got all day. We're the only two allowed to even know about this. So the longer this takes, the longer we can't do the rest of our work. So as soon as they're at the doors, you let me know. What's in it anyway? Did some weapons tech or prototype we should know about? Get it crossed out in any of the paperwork? I'm not sure. I can check with the suit. That won't be necessary. It has all been taken care of. And next time, best you forget enough to even think of asking questions. Well, you heard the man. Let's get this finished and maybe call it a day and go home. Everything is looking good. All set for another test run. So this makes it what? Attempt number 14? 11. You. 11? Never really liked 11. Nothing's ever 11. Sounds... This place. Uh, can we at least please get back to work and finish this? You know, they try so hard to keep this whole thing a secret, but half the time these dumb bots end up being target practice when they go haywire. Why go through all the trouble? Uh, I'm not nearly smart enough to know how it works, but best guess is that I know that they're getting data on it, and each time it appears to be better. So, do it up a hundred times, and maybe we'll get something decent. Yeah, you guys said that about the last one, until it missed the viewing port window as a whole breach and tried to weld it shut, almost breaking the glass. Uh, oh yeah, or number six. It somehow analyzed the sun and said there was a station fire. Set half the deck's automated fire crew on a death wish to try and put out the star. <laughs> Took us a week to find all those little bastards. Luck, all I'm saying is that maybe they shouldn't be doing the same brute force tricks that got us into the split situation to begin with, accidentally making something far better than intended. Some say there are now rogue programs out there who are all waiting for the right moment. To do what exactly? Last I checked, they can't exactly make anything. They were more like parasites that took control of things, but since then, precautions have been made to more manual control and server disconnect points. I'll be surprised if a, a new uprising lasted more than a few weeks or months. No man, these rogue AI types, the Nexus class, were on a whole other level. Back during the split, when the war was at its highest, they were known as the protectorates. They streamed so condensed that they would appear as human figures of pure blue energy and would lead the other AI ships and warbots. If you had anything so much as a nanobot anywhere in that system, you could bet it knew where it was and would try to control it. Whatever, man. If that's the case, then honestly, just give me my good old carbon baseball bat and see how well they feel in trying to hack my swing. <laughs> Alright, yeah, whatever. Let's get this thing over with so we can either go home or have a bit of fun in taking it out before clocking out. Alright, the loading tests run on cooling tunnel. Starting in 3, 2, 1. <laughs>